my name's Ken Hames and I spent 25 years in the British Army, of which the last 16 years was in Special Forces. I joined the Army at the age of 16 and became a tank driver. But I arrived at the Royal Military Academy Santos, got into trouble on day one, um, almost got kicked out of the place, but, but got through it and got into the infantry. All through that Army career I was, I was involved in adventure. I was a cross-country skier, I became a mountain guide and joined the Special Air Service. And really, a tremendous amount of learning on the way of what it was like to lead people, uh, lead men into battle, but also lead men in peacetime. If you collide with that, it's going to go straight into your arm, at least that far. And it was, it was really only when I left the army that I think my learning really began, because I met these people called civilians who didn't march, were habitually naughty, didn't quite understand them. Uh, but I got into the world of business and, and, and business speaking. I'm now able uh, either to come in after dinner and, you know, tell a few, a few raconteur jokes or to deliver the workshop, the platform, the keynote. TT&E, the special forces of banking. I love it, don't you? It's brilliant. <laughs> Off we go. All we need is a berry. Different colour. The Special Air Service obviously is a very secretive organisation, but what it does have is a remarkable set of behaviours um, and values take responsibility, be accountable. So I'm, I'm, quite, I'm quite happy to talk about the SAS. I don't talk about operations, but I do talk about that mantra, who dares wins, and the other strap line, which is, we are the pilgrims, we will always go a little further. And I think that's a very strong message for business because we want people to go that extra mile.